Hello, YouTubers. How are you all? I'm in a different setting because I'm downstairs because I'm cool like that. Anyways, um, I have a very small haul, like uber small. Like, I'm talking four MAC products, a mascara, and a lip gloss small. Anyways, and a little rant because I'm pissed. I'm not pissed, but like, like annoyed. Okay, <clears throat> the city I live in never had um, a Mac Pro store before, and recently one just opened up. So wow, uber uber excited, right? But the thing is, where I go, I go to my little Bay outlet and buy there, and the people know me there. So when I go in, it's not like they come and they like bombard you like you know how some of the Mac girls are like so annoying like they're on your ass all the time and they're like uh do you know what this is for like uh do you need help do you know what this product does like yes I know what it does people it's so annoying anyways I'm like known at my little Mac store in the bay and then I go to this pro store and I'll, I'll tell you about it trust me it's just uh, annoying. This little blonde, like, B-I-T-C-H. I know she's trying to do her job and everything, but, like, I just love knowing probably more than they do about their job. It's amazing. Anyways, um, one of them is really nice. The other one is fucking annoying. Anyways, um, I got my first palette my Mac Pro palette and this is the one the blonde girl was um, I don't know her name anyways I was like I want a 15 pan pro palette and she's like oh, okay so she gets it for me and she's like do you know um, about our eyeshadows I'm like no I just want to buy an empty palette and like you know like like, I don't have stuff to put in it, you know? Like, obviously, I know about your damn eyeshadows, right? Anyways, so I bought the palette. It was amazingly, like, I thought this was going to be, like, way more than it was. Because, like, before we had a pro store, I was looking on eBay for these palettes. And people on eBay are selling them for, like, 25 bucks. Don't buy a palette from eBay. In Canada, $14.50. I was like, wow. I was like, I was expecting it to be so much more, but it's not. And the little quads for us are 450. That's like super cheap. Anyways, so this is my palette. I'll show you later. So back to this woman, this girl. You know the new line, not the new line, not the like, uh, not the Manish or online one but the red she said their new Christmas line for Mac I'm um I get their newsletter through my email Mac so I knew about this red she said line like what earlier in the week already and I guess the pro stores just got it so this woman was like um I'm looking at it with my friends right and she comes up and she's like oh yeah she's like this just launched and I'm like uh, yeah, I, I know, like, I've seen it online, and she's like, okay, so you know about this, and you know about this, and I'm like, yeah, I've seen it online, and she just keeps going on and on and on and on, she's like, yeah, I'm wearing this lip gloss and this lipstick, and it's, like, super gorgeous, and I'm like, okay, and then I was looking at paint pots, because I want to get the Ruminesque paint pot, so I was just looking at it, and she's like, oh, she, she went away from me for a while. So I was like, please, like, stay away. She didn't. As soon as I started looking at the paint pot, she comes up and she's like, she's like, oh, paint pots, you're interested in paint pots. She's like, do you know what they do and how to apply them? And I'm like, yes. <laughs> Leave me alone, Mac girl. <laughs> Honestly, it's so annoying. I hate that they don't know who I am. And I don't want to build a rapport with her because she's freaking annoying. I'm pretty sure if I know her, she'll still be annoying. 
Anyways, I'm just venting. She annoyed me. Anyways, MAC palette. So, of course, um, she's like, oh, do you have eyeshadows for it? I'm like, yeah, I have eyeshadows. She's like, okay. She's like, well, I recommend that you don't take out the single pans because you could really ruin your eyeshadows. And I'm like, um, okay. Uh, obviously not. Obviously, I am going to do both them. I'm not going to buy a 15 thing eyeshadow and, like, leave them in singles. Oof. Anyways, so I, of course... She, like, talked me into buying, of course, the proper pro pan palette thing that come with the little magnet and the eyeshadow. So, I bought two of those. And you know what I realized? These, for the palette, are $13. For Canadians, anyways. The things in these are $17.50. You're paying six fifty for this little plastic container. Isn't that ridiculous? Anyways, so oh, and they're just like magnetized. I'm sure. So I'll just go through the colors that I have. I only have nine Mac eyeshadows. I have ten. I have Night Divine upstairs, but it's like cracking. So yesterday I bought this palette, and I bought Shimmer Moss, which I'm wearing on my eyes, along with. Tilt, the bottom one, and there's a tutorial up for this. You guys can check it out. It will be up momentarily. I'm going to post it after this one. Um, so this is Shimmer Moss. This is Fresh Water. This is Tilt. This one up here, this is Pink Venus. And this is Gleam. And this is Mulch. And this is Stars and Rockets. This is Forgery. And Swimming. And now, I just used Encore's um, depotting routine. Instead of putting, like, all of it up here, because I'm, like, was so paranoid, I just bought um, tab, like, sticky thingies, and I put them at the bottom. Mulch. Oh, my God. Depotting eyeshadows is freaking annoying. <laughs> like, the first couple, you, you need, like, rubbing alcohol to get that glue off of the back of these things because the amount of glue that they put is like retarded, retarded. Ah, <sighs> just that girl annoyed me, you guys. Anyways, so I was done dealing with her. I paid for this and then I paid for the two eyeshadows, whatever. And then I went back into the store and I wanted to ask about the MAC Shark Skin Shade Stick because I was told it was discontinued. Liars. So I went to the other girl because I knew the blonde would like be on my ass be like, did you forget anything? Did you forget anything? So yeah. So I went to the other girl in the MAC store and I asked her about the Shark Skin Shade Stick. I'm like, is it discontinued indefinitely or is it coming back in a line? And she's like, um, it's not discontinued and I'm like what do you mean it's not discontinued she's like well it might be discontinued for like the bay outlets but we have boxes of them and I'm like what I'm like I've been wanting this for so long and she's like yeah she's like it might just been like disconnected at like the bay outlets but we have them and I'm like hmm so I got my MAC shark skin shade stick and I'm super uber uber excited so that's great. And I use that as a base today. Again, you guys will all see that in the tutorial when you go and check it out. Uh, I got Lash Blast, CoverGirl. People talk about it all the time and say it's excellent. Um, it's okay. The brush is like the size of like, like the Empire State Building. It's huge. So I don't like the brush, but the mascara is all right. And I bought this cute Sally Hansen Lipnotic Gem Gloss with the cute, very shimmery thing. And it smells like sunscreen. But there's no SPF. Who would have thought, eh? Anyways, uh, so that's my annoying MAC palette. Not annoying MAC palette, but the annoying girl that sold me the MAC palette. If you want me to do any swatches on this or any looks, uh, let me know. Check out my tutorial. Um, and thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys when I see you. Bye-bye.